now. Delicious cheese we're checking out ahead of a festival this weekend called The Wedge. It's billed as the biggest and best cheese celebration. Let's get the party started early out here on the square. We have Katie Bray from the Oregon Cheese Guild and Rod Volbita with Willamette Valley Cheese and great looking stuff right there. What were you slicing there, Rod? Uh, this is the blue from Rogue. A blue cheese from Rogue? Yes. Okay, I must have a taste. Don't oh, cut yes. my finger there. <laughs> mm. So this event coming up Saturday, it features cheese makers from all across the state. Katie, how prevalent is the cheese industry here in Oregon? Well, we've got a couple of pretty prominent uh, makers. You're familiar with Soma, Rogue Creamery down south, but it also features our little mom and pop operations and everything in between. So, Rod, what will you be showcasing there? You brought a few samples. Yeah, mainly the um, I do Dutch style cheeses, European style. So this is a boring cause, which is a raw milk gouda, and this is a cumin gouda. So it's a gouda with a, a cumin seed, roasted cumin seed in it. Mm, what's um, the secret to a good gouda? Um, the, a good recipe, actually. A good recipe. Yes. But yeah. is it the cream you use? Yeah, or? we use Jersey cows, um, all Jersey milk. So it, it's a lot creamier than most goudas, definitely. Yes. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I understand, Katie, that it's not only the cheese you showcase there at the Wedge, it's everything that you put cheese on or everything that goes with cheese, which wine always goes nicely. You bet. So adult beverages, wine, cider, and beer. And then anything else that you would need to create the ultimate cheese board. So charcuterie, sauces, chocolate, honey, anything you can think of that would go great with cheese. Well, this is a great cheese board right here in the shape of the state of Oregon. Will that be on sale there? We'll have some of those there, yes. Very nice. So, Rod, this event, I know you've been part of it since the very beginning. Yeah, that's right. What yep. does it do for the folks in your industry? Actually, it was very small when we started. Now it's, it's becoming very big because there's a lot more cheesemakers in Oregon now. So I think we're up to how many? Uh, 2,500 20, people last year, yeah. Yeah, so it's, it's grown exponentially every year. Very impressive. Yeah. Before we go, your favorite cheese? Um, you know, I say the boring cause, that's why I brought it. Um, mm -hmm. It's just, it's a raw milk cheese, so you get a really distinct flavor of the Jersey cow milk. And how Definitely. about you, Katie? I love his boring cause too, but um, I'm, I'm partial to the Bloomy Rind goat cheeses. Bloomy Rind goat cheeses, something to check out at the Wedge. Let's put up the details for you. It's happening on Saturday from noon to six at Alder Block, which is the site of the Portland Night Market. And if you need more information, just check out the website, the Wedge. Portland.com. Thanks so much for both of you coming Thank in you. and for the great cheese taste. It's yeah. wonderful.